going to talk to you today about that fence that was built between us and God. The ways of this world and God's ways. Now a lot of people see that fence and, and they, they, they think they can't climb it. They think they're, 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 they haven't got the ability to get over that fence and just serve God. To remove themselves from the ways of this world, which are not good by the way. And so they reside in the world and have no idea how amazing and wonderful it is to submit to God's ways and that your life would find the narrow path and be straight. Then there are those that get to that fence and they climb it and they get on top and they realize, wow, I can be in both from this position. I can be of the world and I can still see God. I can still serve God. Jesus Christ said that he will spit the lukewarm out of his mouth. You see, that fence does not belong to God. It belongs to Satan. It's his fence. It's an illusion. It's a, de it's, it's a deception. If you think you can sit on that fence and do both, you cannot. Jesus said you cannot serve two masters. So if you're sitting on the fence and you think you're going to be able to be of this world and somehow bring glory to God in your behavior in that you are still looking at God but still participating as a person of the world you cannot and a time is coming when that fence is going to get shook to its very core and everybody sitting on it will fall on the side of this world because that's really what you want if you wanted God you wouldn't be sitting on that fence you would have climbed that fence looked over at God and made your way to him through abiding in his word and obeying his commands, submitting to his ways, and not looking back at the world. Jesus Christ said, anybody that grabs the plow and looks back is not worthy to serve me. It's either God or it's nothing. In the end, it will be nothing if you are not serving God in these days, if you have not fully understood what salvation is, and that you would receive it in its fullness. And serve God fully. Give it all to Him. Every bit of it. And I promise you, you will have peace, grace, mercy, love. You will have all that. Get off that fence. Get right with God.